hi everyone i am back with another video and in this video i would be explaining you about how to distinguish me between news pages and normal site pages so there is a very generic requirement where we we as a user wants to create views on the news articles only or uh, want to separate the news articles from normal list pages uh, news pages uh, i mean site pages so uh, in this uh, video i'll be just explaining you about one uh, internal field that is promoted state which can enable you to create a view and uh, differentiate between news pages and site pages so i'm just going to the site pages library so this site pages library i'm having already this promoted state uh, added over here so let me for your sake uh, i would add this promoted state once back in this view so in short what you have to do is click on this add column in the show height columns click on it so you will get a uh, get all the fields including internal ones as well which doesn't get um, visible under the views but it will get visible under this added view columns page so when you check or uncheck this promoted state property and click on apply it will start appearing over here <clears throat> so uh, you must be seeing it uh, that some values are zero some uh, one is two and another is zero again so for normal site pages the value would be always zero and for the news pages it would be one or two so for the draft pages it will be one and for the approved news pages it will be two so now we can make a distinction between what could be news pages or what could be normal site page. So now I am going to create a new view based on this promoted state. I am just going to the list setting. And I am going to create a standard view. So before moving to that, I'll just uh, scroll down to the filters and in the filters, when you try to find out that promoted state uh, property thing, you would not able to see it because these are the classic fields which would be allowing to ma uh, make a filter on. So there's a workaround to do that. So I'm just going back in the list settings. Now I am going to create one new column and that column would be type of article and it's a calculated column because I would be calculating this value on the existing internal field. So though this uh, field would not be available in this uh, uh, directly available in this because I've already used it that's why it's there so you can directly use this field so what it makes is this type of article column will start capturing the value of promoted state and I just uh, around uh, using it uh, data type as number and the decimals I would like to have the value without decimals and now I'm just clicking ok so this calculated column would be created for me and let me go back to the site pages so in the calculated this type of article column it start uh, capturing the same values which promoted state is having so now going back to the library settings because we would like to create a view for the news article now i'll create a view standard view and news articles and when we move down to the filters we'll start seeing that our calculated column property there so as we would like to just show the news which are in draft and approved as well so we would be just putting the condition as type of article not equal to zero and clicking ok now this is a test news article so that's why it's showing under this news articles view and when I 
click all pages it will show all the rest of the pages so including news article and that normal site pages so for a quick test i'll just create one demo news article from my this news web part picking a blank one test news demo submitting this page so I'm just submitting it now it's pending for approval so I would like to go back to the site page library so that you can see what value does it contain so I'm just uh, going back to the news article view now you could see because this news article page is in draft state and submitted for approval that's the column the promoted state column value is one and we have made a filter on one and two I mean not equal to zero that's why it's showing there so if the news article is approved it will not uh, uh, it will uh, show with a value of two <clears throat> so I think that that's a, a very good workaround to to make up filters between the same site pages library make a distinction between the news pages and the normal pages so I hope it's it is helpful for you thanks a lot I'll be back with another interesting video soon thank you